Oh, alright, here we are playing a Faulty 98 stage once again. Um, I just played through one of his stages, but yeah, we're here doing yet another one. A Mega Man 1 inspired level. At that, very much like Power Man from Gamer from the Web there. So, yeah. The stage is indeed very cool, very nice backgrounds, and you know, the tide works. Tide work is also very nice. It all just meshes together very well. These jumps are kind of scary without, yeah. Well, without the slide, the slide wouldn't really help there, but the, the, the jumps are scary. But, but, yeah. Oh, and I also, you know, much lost, much like the last level I played from Fauti, um, I went ahead and did a test run of this game or of this stage, and, you know, just so that I knew I could do it without, like, dying. 15 times or whatever, you know, <laughs> but actually this level is not as difficult as for these other stages It's actually yeah, it's just a regular difficulty stage here. I would personally say So yeah, it's nice to see him build like something more casualized here And here you can rush here and you know run through their bodies you can't do that in the original Mega Man 4 game, but yeah, in Mega Man Maker you can, but it's a little bit risky doing that, because if you do that and one of these bullet guys counts, they will just knock into the pit, so yeah, I'm just gonna take it slow here. Slow and steady wins the race. Oh, yo! <laughs> Backed up from the freaking missile dude and took it from the skeleton man instead. And wow, I'm just... He's getting killed over here. Let's just get this. It's a bit scary, uh, but yeah, that's pretty much like the same. You know, this is the exact same room like the first uh, one we started actually. Like the exact replica, I think. More or less. <laughs> Interesting. Like, yeah, I totally could have dodged that guy there, but I just. Yeah, I wasn't focused. What can I say? We do have a. Yeah, here, this jump is a little bit tricky. Needless to say, I took damage here on my blind attempt. But I managed to! What? <laughs> wow, I'm very happy I managed to do that. I did not expect to make that jump. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> That's sweet. <laughs> oh, yeah, and the. Here, you know, the classic Mega Man 1 hallway here. With the crab guys. Just gotta be wary of them and shoot and jump. And a standard Skullman fight here. And I forgot to comment on it, but yeah, the way past the B guy there, you know, towards the boss gate looked uh, really cool there too, you know. How the background kind of has that diagonal cut in it, or however you should describe it, yeah. Just a very, very ominous looking final hallway there. Dang it. But they shouldn't have too many problems with Skullman here. Um, I'm pretty... I'm pretty decent at Mega Man 4, so yeah, I don't... Yeah, I typically know what I'm doing against this guy here. Um, but yeah, uh, never count him out. Uh, if he starts getting hits on you, you die very rapidly. <laughs> Much like with most Mega Man 4 bosses, actually, except Pharaoh Man. Pharaoh Man has very low damage, actually. But yeah, very cool stage. Short and sweet, and standard difficulty. No, you know, except for that one jump there with the little... What are they called? The spine enemy there from Mega Man 1. Like, that is probably the hardest dodge there in the entire stage. Everything else is pretty on standard, you know, with a traditional stage there, I would say. Yeah, but very sweet, very cool stage, nice visuals, like, I think I like these visuals here from this stage better than I did, let's see, the, what was it called? Let me go and check here on the channel. Uh, yeah, Lake of Young, I think the visuals were much better uh, here in this stage. Lake of Young had decent visuals, but Venom Mines, uh, yeah. Much, I mean, much better, uh, even better, I should say. Uh, I really like the visuals in this one. It all looked cool, and especially the backgrounds looks very nice. And yeah, 
very good job for the 98, but it was nice to play another stage from you here, a slightly easier one at that, so yeah, I will just leave it at that, so thank you guys for watching, and have a nice day.